And they're underway. Ball find looks like it's going to find space too. It sits up nicely. Alea eventually gets hold of it. Took a while now as Etty Etty charges into it. Finds Jonah Anderson. Jonah, they decide to run it. Martin, Martin, he's got Ilsefer outside of him. Uses him beautifully. Ducks back in off the right foot. They run it on the last. And Erendale are in early through their number four, Jacob Ilsefer. The perfect start for Erendale. At home, a friendly reception from the crowd behind us, Sully. What a great... Calmly adds the extras. So 6 0 Arendale lead early. A layer. Underneath. Charging onto it. Carr. His second run in the set as he brings it underneath on the last. 20 out. It goes back to Jonah Anderson. He puts it high. It's a nice kick. Sweeney underneath. Eel Seffer there. Oh, Eel Seffer plucks it out of the air. And he's got an early double. What a try. Again, Anderson feeds. Cachotti picks it up, finds a layer. Quickly out the car. Now, car, he's making yards up that far side. He's got Clutterbuck out, outside. He's got a layer inside. And he says, I don't need either of you. And scores in the corner. He says a clean pair of heels as Regan Carr. Slowed down by Miller. Cachotti, Cachotti finds Etty, Etty, bangs one out of the way. And they hold him up. They look for all money he was going to reach there. And Cachotti oh. says, I will, though. And it was a quick play, the ball from Etty. And Cachotti goes, here we go, let me roam. And off he went. Gash moves in. I'll tell you what, he's nearly put it up at the Queen and Lees Club. He's kicked it that far. Jack Anderson, Swager, his first touch. He bounces off one, but underneath. Oh, he keeps it alive. Alaya picks it up. He tries to go straight through the middle. Be dangerous. He steps one. Eventually, Marbani drags him down. Cachotti, Jonah Anderson. Out to Sam Gash, Sam Gash. He'll just go slice straight through the gap, and he'll score out wide. Beautiful backline play there. As the done thing now, Cachotti at the back, he'll pick it up. Finds Jonah Anderson. Jonah Anderson got Noah Martin short. He's going to be unstoppable from there. A beautiful line again from Noah, Noah Martin. And to so judge. Gash will move in. He shouldn't have any problems with that one. He... It's one of his quicker <laughs> kick for goals. Get the offload away. Cachotti again, scheming. Jonah Anderson, Martin. Good tackle underneath. Had to be made. Mitchell Sweet it was. Cachotti again. They come again. Scott misses him. Eventually. Plekis. He keeps it alive though. Martin. This time he really does head, get ahead of steam. And he scores his second try in the space of three minutes. Cachotti just got a brilliant offload out the back there. I didn't even know if you could see. Might be your answer. I think what's happened is, I think Jonah Anderson might, well, no, Jack Anderson, of course. He can play dummy half as, as well, and he's gone in. Miller saying, I've got it, sir, as Gash does hang on to it. Jack Anderson finds Castle. Castle on the air tee. Bit of play between the two front rowers. On the last, Hovey. He gets it. He's got the left boot, of course. He finds space. Referee says, you're all offside. As McSpadden puts it on the toe, still going, picks it up and will score in the corner. A great individual try. McSpadden. They'll kick more than what they miss. This time he moves in nicely. Look at that, he's swinging it around beautifully. Yeah, your money was right. Oh. Jonah Anderson now, he'll find Martin. Martin grates through the gap. He's got runners inside and outside. Who's he going to give it to? He gives it now to Jacob Eosefa. And in turn, Gash, Gash, backing up through the middle. Dives through one, dives through two, and scores under the post. It's just too easy, Sully. Far too easy. Jonah Anderson toying with the defence. He's taking it right to the line. See, but the same, same procedure. Doesn't change. 
don't know if I've ever seen that before. Seems to be working, bud. Oh, it works. The top. Came hammered in the 14. McSpadden had looked now. Carr. Carr says, oh, it gives Mercer a lovely pass. Mercer, he's getting ahead of steam now. He'll come back inside. Ankle tap it was, and he got through as Cliff had to... Jack Anderson looks up. Hovey, Hovey, underneath for Carr, charging onto the footy. Mar Barney, keep, he does well, keeps it alive now. Just Jack Anderson, going. he'll throw the dumb and he'll score. Untouched. Mar Barney had the great one-on-one -on -one effort there, but they got the offload away and great footwork at the line. He goes over untouched. Didn't have any problems as the touch judges. They just put the flags in the air. Referee Miles and puts his hand in the air. In the air, Mabani. Jack Anderson finds Swager. Swager. He runs at Miller. You've seen the 11 there a fair bit in the blue side. He tackled well as well. They go to the short side with Castle. Castle driving it through the middle again. And this is where it started with their forwards. Jonah Anderson, short pass for Eeyore Sefer. We haven't mentioned him much in this second half since he scored two early tries. He keeps it alive for Gash. Gash following through the middle, and he gets through the middle. He's got Hovey with him. Hovey, it's a race to the line. Has Hovey got the speed? I think he has as he plants the ball down with Tio Rua on top of him. But some good work through the middle. Jack Anderson. Looks up, Swager, he had, he finds Martin. Martin on that left, right side now, he's still got Swager with him. Martin says, no way you know I'm going for three, and that'll do me. What a try. We just spoke about his footwork, Sully. You can see a couple of frustration kicking in there, Phil Awara. As I say, it took them a lot, we, as we both said, it took them a long time to... Add to that half-time score, which was 34-0. 34-0 lead at half-time as Illawarra Sports try and grab some points to end the game as it ends up with Mitchell Sweet, who fires it out to Cleveland van der Lark. And a good tackle coming across there. You can hear the, the generous crowd here at Seaford Oval. Acknowledging a good win there. 64 points to nil as referee Cage Miles blows full time. Well, I'll tell you what, if I was the, the couple of the Victorian sides uh, that we mentioned that are in the pool as well, Hallam College and, and the Grange P12 College,